Hello, I'm Tristan from Smart Home Point. Last year, LifeX announced the LifeX Clean, an A19 bulb that can apparently act as a disinfectant. This is obviously a timely product considering the global pandemic and that a generation of clean conscious people has appeared, understandably. Also, as a big nerd, I found the idea of a light bulb that can kill germs pretty interesting. So I've been researching it and I wanted to shoot this video and talk about whether the marketing lives up to the reality. The idea behind this product is basically that you use it as a normal light bulb when you're around, but then you can schedule or manually enable a cleaning cycle, ideally at night. After eight to 12 hours, a decent number of bacteria might be killed. This is designed to be used when you're not near it for reasons I'll explain later. Now, to be clear, I am not a scientist or a safety research person. I don't know what they're called. I haven't sort of doused all my surfaces in E. coli and run some CSI Miami level tests on them. Yes, there's definitely significant traces of E. coli here. Ew. But I can say whether this is a genuine product or a scam, like some cynics have claimed. This is because various independent scientific tests have already been carried out on it. The short answer is that yes, it does work, but it won't kill viruses, like the germs that cause flu and COVID-19, and it probably won't help much if you have the LifeX Clean just in your ceiling. This product is designed to sit fairly close to a surface and run a cleaning cycle over multiple hours. Right, let's get into the details. You might know that UV, ultraviolet light, can kill germs, whether that's bacteria or viruses. However, you might also know that UV light is bad, it can significantly increase the risk of developing skin cancer, for example. As a result, a smart bulb that pumps out loads of UV light probably wouldn't be a good idea. Thankfully though, there is an alternative, HEV light, which stands for High Energy Visible Light. This sits on the violet or the blue band of light, pumping out 405 nanometer light, which is just on the edge of the visible spectrum. Unlike UV light, there's no research linking HEV light to an increased risk of skin cancer, which is good. There are, however, studies suggesting that HEV light can harm your skin, causing it to dry out or age prematurely. For this reason, whilst LifeX say fairly correctly that the LifeX clean bulb is safe for humans and pets, they also say that you should run it in the hours that you're not using it. This seems sensible advice. When it's in cleaning mode, you wouldn't actually want uh, it to be pointing at your keyboard, for example, whilst you type for hours. As I mentioned earlier, the idea behind this product is essentially that you run it when you're not around, such as at night. It's also most effective when pointed directly at a surface from one or two feet away. It's not designed to simply be put in your ceiling and run for a couple of hours. This brings us on to the specific scientific studies. One detailed study tested HEV light in general and another tested LifeX Clean's offering directly. Both concluded that as much as 99.99% of bacteria can be killed when this is run overnight. Although this is when the bulb is pointing directly at a surface from just 40 centimeters, which is 1.4 foot away and run for eight to 12 hours. If the bulb is uh, four foot away and running cleaning mode only for four hours, it might not even kill half of the present staph bacteria. In my case, the distance between my kitchen spotlight and my kitchen worktop is closer to five foot away. So the LifeX clean bulb probably wouldn't be too helpful here. In fact, I can't find any data showing that HEV light is fully effective on bacteria at five foot away. All the studies seem to be for four foot or closer distances. Indeed, the detailed testing done on the LifeX clean bulb found that it can kill up to 75% of bacteria when run overnight from a standard height kitchen or bathroom light but they also clarified that this is from just four foot away and when it's run for a whopping 12 hours. This might sound good to you, especially since kitchens and bathrooms can of course be high risk areas for picking up bacteria, but not everyone will be able to run cleaning cycles for 12 hours at a time and from just four foot away. So this is one downside with a product like LifeX Clean it's not always going to be clear whether something is a surface is fully clean or not. A 75% reduction in bacteria sounds good, but if your light is slightly further away than the research uh, suggests and the cleaning cycle only runs for six hours, for example, 
then there will still be a decent amount of bacteria left on a particular surface. So the short of it is that LifeX Clean is a genuine product that can kill bacteria, but you need to be aware that it's most effective from one or two feet away. The further away you start getting, and the less time you run it in cleaner mode, the less bacteria gets killed. As a result, this product is probably worth buying if you want to disinfect your keyboard and mouse areas overnight, for example. But it is, there is, of course, a cheaper and arguably better alternative. Regular hand washing and general good hygiene. Without these standard measures, no amount of smart lighting uh, or smart light cleaning will really be helpful. Equally, I'd be wary about mounting this in my own kitchen or bathroom ceiling because it would be from almost five foot away and I'd only be able to run it for seven or eight hours max, which probably wouldn't kill all that much bacteria, probably less than half. And that just about wraps up this video. I'll put links to this interesting product and the scientific research papers down in the description. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please click the thumbs up button, which will tell YouTube that more people should watch this video. Please also consider subscribing and also click in the little bell icon, which will notify you when I release a new video. Thank you.